I'm Jeremiah Jonke, editor of Wild Sports. I'm here on my 4A football tour with longtime Natrona coach Steve Harshman. You know, coach, the one thing that uh, you know has really stood out about your program, especially as of you know recently, is that it doesn't matter how many guys you graduate. You know, just uh, you know, it looks like you graduate a big senior class, and maybe you're right for the pick in the next year. But you guys still don't skip a beat. You're still state title contenders. What have you done that has allowed you to kind of have that sort of continuity? Well, I think. Um the thing that's really changed for us is, I think, freshman football, frankly. We're, it used to be at the junior highs and the in in junior high concept, and we were a 10 through 12. Now we're a 9 through 12, and uh, I think our seniors have done such a great job from day one of just mentoring those freshman guys, getting them up to speed, and then I think... I think the other piece we, you know, football is such a developmental game. It, it doesn't happen for you as a freshman or sophomore generally in 4A football. So it takes time. And I think we've had kids who have gotten playing opportunities, freshman, sophomore, JV. And then when it's their turn as a senior, and we've got a lot of junior players too, but generally um, they've developed more. And uh, I think, you know, but I think number one, I think our seniors have done a great job with our young kids. Well, you mentioned playing opportunities, and that's one thing that's, that stood out to me. You know, it seems like every time there's a six-man team with a hole in its schedule or a 1A team with a hole in its schedule, it's not uncommon to see Natrona in some form or fashion pop up in on that schedule. You know, how, how important have those games, you know, no matter what kind of football it is, how important has that been to the development of your team and just kind of keeping kids engaged and, you know, knowing that, all right, well, I may not be playing the premier level of this team, but I know I'm still going to be playing football. Well, I think that's key. Every kid that goes out for a sport wants to play. Nobody goes out just to practice and, and stand on the sideline hanging on your shoulder pads or your helmet tip back watching your friends play. And I think there's a point to that when you get to the varsity level. I mean, you play, but we still try to find a lot of roles for guys. But uh, uh, I think that's the key is providing those, those playing opportunities. We've never canceled a game in 25 years and 26 years. and. So, um, you know, that's the deal, I think, provide those opportunities for kids. Well, you know, like I said, a lot of turnover from last year, a lot of guys, All-State players missing. But, uh, you know, who are some of the guys that come October, we're going to know their names? Well, I think Tom Robitaille played every game for us, started last year, the linebacker, and he's gotten bigger and stronger. He was a, kind of an inside receiver. He'll play more tight end this year. And, and uh, I think he'll be a, a big part of that. Carlos Daniels, another guy who played a lot. David Shaw was a starter on the offensive line. We won't have him for the Central game. He's, he's at basic training. He joined the National Guard and has been there the last two months. I think those three guys, I think, are Isaac Stewart, another big kid, 315 pounds, 6'6", senior. Uh, it's only his third year of football, but he's really come a long ways. And, and uh, so, but I think too, then these seniors also know they're a pretty small class uh, and they know they're going to have some juniors and a few sophomores that are going to, and maybe even a freshman that'll contribute at that varsity level. And so I think what they're doing, their mission is, is to make sure you know their names by October, these young kids, because they realize for them to have a successful season, it's going to be a whole team thing. Uh, and, and really a key will be senior leadership, bringing the young kids along quickly. All right, well, we got to get Coach Harshman off to an appointment. I'm Jeremiah Jonk with Wild Sports. Thanks for having us on the 4A football tour. I appreciate you coming up.